we're developing a, a technology that's called single cell western blotting, which is a mechanism to detect proteins uh, from single cells. And this is really great because uh, patients that have diseases like breast cancer, let's say, uh, in their cells, there's uh, within each cell, there's cell to cell uh, variation. So the proteins in each cell are very important to developing a better diagnosis and, and creating better uh, drugs for these patients. So what we're trying to do, what the, the lab has actually done, is created a way to detect proteins in single cells. But unfortunately, when you do the electrophoresis and you get your protein bands out, you can actually get proteins that are very low concentrations and you can't actually detect these proteins accurately. So our solution to this is to create a system for thermocycling in order to allow in-gel nucleic acid amplification. So our method is to uh, target these proteins of interest that we're interested in. They could be proteins associated with cancer and tag them with an antibody. So these antibodies bind very tightly to these proteins of interest. And then what we do is we attach short sequences of DNA to these antibodies, which then allows them to be replicated by a process called nucle nucleic acid amplification. One of the most common methods of nucleic acid amplification is PCR, polymer chase polymerase chain reaction. So in order to do this, we need to raise the temperature and lower the temperature repeatedly. That's why we're developing a thermocycler for in-gel nucleic acid amplification.